30 years ago today, that all changed. The bits between the shows were named Children's BBC and a presenter appeared in Vision each afternoon on BBC One. We're back again. They've let us loose. I can't believe it. The first presenter was Philip Schofield. Yay! He's a mate of mine. Presenting in a tiny room that became known as the Broom Cupboard. I'm terribly sorry about this, but one of our bulbs has just gone. We have got a super duper graphic here. You're going to love this. You ready for this? Right, watch that. Look at that. On the computer. Now a TV legend, but then a newcomer, Philip was a natural and set the standard for everything that followed. Up you go. You could do funny. You're looking particularly stunning tonight. Serious. Don't forget that there are blue Peter subtitles on CFAX page 888. In fact, he could do it all. That's how to do it, isn't it? Except maybe singing and dancing. Ulysses. Moving on. In 1986, Philip was joined by Gordon the Gopher. Right, oh, oh, sorry. And the first CBBC double act was born. <laughs> have you seen his jumper? Oh, come on, talk to me. Look, have you look at this jumper? It says, I'm with the idiot on here. Look. Later, there was Debbie Flint. Hello, hello, and welcome Hello, to love. <laughs> and Andy Crane. Yeah. Every day's around the world. Sorry about that. With his mates, Ed the Duck. Oi. <laughs> And Wilson the butler. Yeah, thank you, Wilson. What, Ed? What? Who are always causing trouble. Are you ready yet? Northern Ireland are nearly going. <laughs> Ow! Why are you in colour? I do all the work in here, and he takes all the credit. That's enough of all that messing about, isn't it? Next, there was Simon. I don't have to press any button, so I know this one will work first time. Da, 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 da. Now then. Another Simon. I used to be a werewolf, and I'm all right. No! And another Andy, but this time with an eye. All right then, Ed, you can come back. <laughs> I'm so dynamic, aren't I? Then Philippa. Can you please massage my feet? <laughs> and Toby. Are you ready for this? Each brought something different. But most of them had bad hair. Oi! But every broom cupboard presenter had to contend with doing all the technical stuff themselves. What you have here is a fully operational continuity desk which could lead to some interesting moments. Oh, well, we put, yeah. Are we going to carry on? Hello? Are you there next door? I can't hear your talk. But that live, unpredictable feel... Oh, some would say shoddy. Oh, oh. ...made CBBC what it is today.